guys, welcome to Empowered. My name is Caroline Porter Thomas. Thank you so much as usual for watching my YouTube channel. So in this video, I wanted to tell you a little moisturizing trick that I've been doing for the past few months and I'm absolutely in love with it. So I absolutely love going to the kitchen and seeing different ways that I can use different things that we usually eat. Because if you don't know, the things that we do put on our skin can get into our lymphatic system and our bloodstream. So it's pretty important that you watch the things that you do put on your skin. So a few months ago, I was reading online that Alessandra Ambrosio, she's the Victoria's Secret model that's just drop dead gorgeous and has perfect skin and she's, I think she's like 34, 35, but she still looks absolutely amazing. So I was reading online that she puts avocado on her skin and it got me thinking. I was like, I absolutely love avocados and a few years ago when I started eating avocados on a regular basis, I noticed a big difference in my skin as well. So I was like, well, why don't I try to put it on my skin and see what happens? So I looked online for a recipe and I saw that if you put avocado with a vitamin E, it's even better. And so that's what I've been doing every morning. I've been waking up and mashing up an avocado and putting some vitamin E tablets. I just bought the tablets from, there's a CVS like right by my house. So I just went and bought some cheap tablets, probably if you got organic or really high grade it might be better I don't know but I've noticed a big difference just using a really you know inexpensive brand I'll show you the one that I use I can't remember the name off the top of my head because I didn't think about it and I've noticed a big difference just from that so one other thing that I noticed was that I had some sunspots that I was getting a little bit worried about you know I'm Caucasian I live in Florida I've always wanted to be a little bit on the tanner side, which if you can't tell now, I'm trying to trying to get used to my whiteness self. But um, you know, just being Caucasian, you do get you know freckles or sunspots every now and then, unfortunately. And so I had some that were coming in here like pretty dark, and some of them were so dark that even when I had foundation on, I would take a picture and it would still be there. So I was really getting worried about it. But then after doing this for a few months. I promise you, but I think it's getting lighter and lighter. So I'm really excited about that because I feel like in a few more months, I might not have any sunspots. So I've kind of started putting it on my whole body too. I, I won't show you that because that wouldn't be appropriate, but I will show you how I put it on my face. I usually do this first thing in the morning. So I wake up first thing in the morning. I always make vegetable juice for myself and my husband. I like to have fresh vegetable juice for the day. And so it's the perfect opportunity for me to leave this on my skin for about 30 minutes because it takes me about 30 minutes to make the vegetable juice. So I pretty much just wake up, drink a big glass of water, go out, start mashing up this avocado and mixing this concoction together put it on my skin, start doing the juice. 30 minutes later, I'm done with the juice. I rinse it off my face and that's it. Oh, I forgot to mention, also before I do that, I usually exfoliate, like a, a light exfoliation. I usually do that daily. I've found the best results on my skin daily, so I, but it's light, it's not like a heavy exfoliation. Since I've been doing that, I have found that I don't really need to wear moisturizer anymore, and I do think that that could depend on where you live. Obviously, living in Miami, Florida, I'm going to have more humidity than if I were to live in Connecticut, so you might need to adjust that based on where you live. And when I do put it on my whole body, um, I will just put it on, same thing, leave it on for about 30 minutes, and then I will just take a shower and rinse it off, and not wash it off with any soap, just simply rinse it off, and there you go. I usually do that though when I've taken a shower, maybe like the night before, so I'm already clean, I'm just doing this for moisturizer. So all right, let me show you exactly how I do it. So for this, you'll just need one ripe avocado. One avocado will last you a few days. So just one slice is kind of all you need and just mash it up really good. Try to get as many big bumps out of there as possible. As you can see, I'm doing this pretty vigorously. The smoother the better. And this is the vitamin E tablets that I use. Again, I just got this from CVS. It's probably a cheap brand. 
and you can just cut it and or put a little hole and squeeze it out. They might sell vitamin E by itself, they probably do. This was just an easy thing for me to get. And then so you just stir it with the mashed up avocado and it'll make the consistency a little bit thicker and smoother. You're never going to get all the bumps out, but that's about how it looks. So I, of course, always put my hair up when I'm putting it on my face, so I don't get any in my face. Again, I do a quick exfoliation, a light one, and then just put it on the skin. There's really no order or anything. I do have to say it feels so cool and refreshing. I love it. I, I love really focusing on the eyes because that's where we get a lot of wrinkles. Sometimes I do the upper lid and sometimes I don't, just kind of depends. And of course the forehead. So I wanted to show you a close-up. As you can see, it's just like it's like a light green consistency. And then when it dries, it might it'll get just a little crusty. Focusing on the eyes again. <laughs> and that's it. Ready for the day. Just kidding. <laughs> Alright guys, I really hope that you liked that video. If you want to see more videos with more beauty tips, then just give this video a thumbs up and I would love to make them for you. I do have a lot of other natural things that I do. So if that does interest you, then let me know. I do have some vitamins that I've been taking, so if you guys want to hear videos on those, then give this video a thumbs up or post it in the comment below, preferably if you don't mind, and give it a thumbs up. <laughs> And anyways, I can't wait to see you guys very soon in my next video. I love you so much. Thanks for watching. Bye.